But I've always been big, and it's always been up and down. It's never been steady. It's never been one weight for a long period of time. I, go, I went through periods like my senior year. I, I've had anxiety my entire life, too, and when the anxiety would get bad, I think it was because I felt like crap about my weight, um, and that's when I'd start to fix a little bit. Like senior year, I was thin, mm -hmm. but for like six months, that was it. Feel your heartbeat. Um, I, my anxiety was through the roof with it. I sweat all the time. I didn't eat at all. I did not eat on it. Um, there was a period where I, when I lived in Pittsburgh, I lived in Pittsburgh for a while. Um, for work, I would have a can of vegetable soup, which is like, I think it's zero fat. It's I used to read the lab labels like no other. I used to be really paranoid about it. And I would have that can of soup a day, and that's, that's it. And coffee. Lived on coffee, too. Okay, from a science perspective, she was taking a metabolism enhancer, which was fooling her body. So when that pill was non existent, her metabolism was nothing. It was very low. Would you completely, completely overwhelming. Um, in a good way, I don't want to say that in a right. bad way at all. I have had messages every five minutes for the past two days on Facebook. People that I haven't talked to in 15 years, old neighbors, family members, uh -huh. um, strangers, people I've never even seen. And I started to send you a friend request the other night. I thought, well, maybe I better meet her first. I can tell you this. If I, <laughs> I, if I would have put, <laughs> put on Facebook today that she was going to be here, there have been people here to meet her. That's so many people, so they don't want to That's why. Like myself again, feeling how I used to feel. Um, I never, for the longest time, looked in the mirror and saw someone big, even though I was big. Um, and all of a sudden, out of nowhere, I like woke up and just my confidence went. I mean, it just. I don't feel like myself. I miss out on things because I don't go. I mean, we live in Bath. We live right on the water. And um, I've got friends down there. They're on the boat every day. I don't go half the time because I don't. I was wondering. One thing that I didn't think would come out of it that I'm already seeing with me is me having the ability to help others. That, to me, is huge. So my entire life, I will put others before me. And that's probably why I'm at the point I'm at, because I went to the side where I would put other people ahead of me. But already, I'm helping others. And that, to me, is really exciting. That pumps me up a little bit more.